Well, hello and welcome everyone. My name's Kenny. Today we're unboxing this Alpha Cool Ice Ball. Uh, as I, for whatever reason, love to mispronounce, and I didn't realize that the the uh, their logo. I always thought that said Oh Cool. I don't know why. <laughs> I'm just an idiot, I guess. A big dumb idiot. Um, so first things first. Instruction manual, which comes in multiple languages. Deutsch. Right there. Cool. Uh, and as you can see my background there, the. Uh, D5 pump that I'm reusing from the other one. I'm going to put it in this one. Um, it does come with a whole bunch of Velcro and different methods of attaching things. Here you can see the uh, how the RGB connects. It's got this own proprietary thing, and or you can just use a regular ARGB header. All right, let's get into the actual unboxing of things. Here's all the uh, mounting hardware and various things like that. Nothing really that important in there other than that stuff. But here we got the actual ice bar. It's a kind of a cool looking thing, actually. I bought this on Amazon because it uses a D5 pump, and I was like, I can just reuse this pump, and I don't have to buy a whole reservoir combo and stuff like that, and save a whole lot of money. Here you can see where the pump actually mounts in here. You just unscrew this bottom piece, and uh, yeah, the pump goes in there, and you reseal it, and it comes with a little fancy thing to torque it down. Kind of nice. I actually kind of dig this thing. It's kind of silly looking and not traditional looking, but I think that's kind of why it, it gravitates towards me a little bit. Plus it fits really nice in the case. The instructions explicitly say to adjust your pump too, like before you kind of install it, because um, some of these pumps you can't control the speed with the software, it's all hardware. Um, so, <laughs> but it's pretty simple stuff feed the cord through there, nice cable management, and then screw this bastard back together <laughs> and you're pretty much ready to rock other than, you know, installing your fittings and your piping and whatnot, or your tubing rather. Go ahead and set him down and go ahead with the rest of the unboxing. Got a few more things left in here, trivial kind of knickknacks for mounting and stuff. There's really nothing else. I mean, it comes with pretty much all the hardware you need. Um, and there's multiple different ways of mounting it. Um, you can use that big plate with Velcro. You can mount it to a radiator. Uh, there's a couple different ways you can do it. And it's kind of nice that it comes with a, a little bit of versatility as far as you know ways to do that. I kind of appreciate that about it. Um, but yeah, it comes with uh, pretty much everything you need. And there's a little torque wrench thing for, if you, if you want to call it that, I guess, to... Uh, Tighten up the, the bottom half here with your pump in it. Make sure it's nice and sealed and won't leak. Gotta have that. Otherwise, it's pretty hard to do it otherwise. So, but yeah, this is a pretty nifty little thing. Here's the Velcro like I was talking about earlier. You can use that to mount it to this plate and use the screws that are included here. There's the cords for the RGB lighting and the uh, whatnot. Because like I said, you're, I was reusing my pump, so the pump has its own Molex thing. So nothing fancy, but it is what it is. There's your little metal bracket. Um, I'm not mounting it to a radiator in mine. Obviously, you've already seen those videos with it installed and stuff, but I still wanted to kind of do this unboxing for whatever reason. I'm not entirely sure, but just for fun, I guess. Um, but I opted to use um, this method here, which I think... No, wait, these do have to go in first, because then the bracket sits on this, and then you attach um, the Velcro to the bracket, and then attach the velcro to the case or wherever you're planning on mounting it in my case it was to the base plate of the case so yeah and it comes with uh necessary screws to the tools rather like allen wrenches and whatnot to install the stuff so everything's here you don't really have to supply your own crap it's kind of cool and there's the bracket it's got countersunk uh holes in it too so the screws will sit in nice and flush nice machining I mean, it's, it seems like it's a pretty sweet product. Like, it's not like, it's probably not for everybody because it's not, like I said, not a very traditional type of, uh, like, pump reservoir combo type of thing. But I'll admit it, like, I kind of dig it. It's, like I said, it's different. It looks cool. Um, once it's all filled up and everything, it looks really nice too. <laughs> Giggity. But yeah, that's about, uh, that's about it for, I guess, the unboxing and kind of like tutorial installing it. Um, really. Not much else to say about it other than 
I dig it so far. It looks good. Um, perfectly functional. The D5 pump is a super reliable pump, so I think this thing will be nice and happy inside that uh, inside uh, its new little server home thing. And the price was right, especially if you are going to be re reusing the uh, your a D5 pump from a different reservoir or something like that. And stumble, I, I I I stumbled upon this on Amazon. I don't even know if Amazon was selling it or if it was like another seller, but whatever. It is what it is, you guys. Um, Ice Ball by Alpha Cool pretty cool product if I don't mind saying myself I kind of dig it hey guys thank you so much for hanging out and watching uh, this random unboxing hopefully it wasn't too terribly boring for you but whatever it is what it is take it easy be well and uh, I'll catch you in the next one